Now, what is your definition of an OG? Uh, OG is somebody who gives the younger people guidance or uh, how to move and how to like carry yourself, like basically how to carry yourself. OG can be a different term for different uh, locations across America. Yeah. Where you're from um, in Jacksonville, is an OG, does that have to do with gang activity or can one not be part of a gang and still be considered an OG? Yeah, you could, you could, you could like your mama could be an OG, your grandma could be an OG. Like, it's crazy. An older, a older guy from your block can be an OG. Like, somebody who like you look up to giving you guidance, like they've been looking out for you, that's your OG. Like, but did the word OG, did that stem from gang culture, gang activity? Like original gangster? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, hell yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's what it stands for, original gangster. And then I yeah, guess yeah. it just transcended in time to maybe like a family member or an older yeah. person that might not be into yeah, a gang. Exactly. Is there an age that one can be considered an OG? Oh, yes. My little brother, Kenny K, he's only 15. He an OG. He got all his respect, dog. He, he's an OG already. He's an OG. Typically, like, people think of an OG as an older person. That's crazy, too. That's why I be, like, this man, like, he the reason I switched my religion, my religious belief. Like, he taught me a lot. That one, he taught me a lot of shit. My, my life, I'm like, dude, you only 15, dude. How you, how you know all this shit? That just showed me, like, these just know too much, man. Mm. Yeah, that shit crazy, man. Is that common now for young people to be an OG at that age, or is that like not the norm? That's like a once in a while thing. Somebody like a fifteen year old is. That ain't normal. He ain't normal, dog. I know a couple of them though, but he, him by himself, personally, he not normal, dog. He's special. Mm. He's special to me. How do you think he acquired knowledge and information so young? and able to retain it. Because usually young people, when they get information, it's one ear out the other. They are, you know, you gotta, what's the phrase? They, uh, somebody could say the stove is hot yeah. and they'll still touch it anyways to yeah. just double check or m might burn themselves. Um, what makes, how do you think he's been able to do what he has compared to maybe other 15 year olds that don't lack the same type of retaining of information or knowledge, he, sort of thing. he he stay in them books, man. I could say that he stay in them books, reading and teaching. Like he'll be, we could be in a group on the block. He'll just walk up, go to preaching about some shit, dog. Some old real life shit though, that's going on in the world. You'll be like, how the fuck you know about this shit, man? He, man, I just read about this shit. Mm -hmm. Look at it. Mm -hmm. like, yeah, man, it's crazy, dog. What about the term big homie? Is that the same thing as an OG, or is that different? That's different. Your big homie could be anybody, like anybody that's older than you. It's just your big homie, like. But they could be used as OG, but big homie, like, yeah, it's like, it's different. You think of it as different? Mm-hmm, it's different. Lesser in value? Yeah, it's lesser in value. OG, that's like a higher status. Ah. A higher status. 